Let's speak to Hisham Jaba. Hisham is the head of the Middle East Center for Studies and Political Research, and he joins us now from Beirut. Hisham, thank you so much for your time. This sectarianism that's uh, been demonstrated quite clearly in the fighting that's been going on around Beirut for the past few days, has it always been there, or is it making a dramatic comeback? Yes, sir. Uh, uh, as you said, uh, Lebanon, uh, since 43 days, uh, uh, we see a demonstration, a revolt, uh, kind of, uh, uh, of uh, protest, uh, which is the, for the first time in Lebanon has no color, a political color, no uh, sectarian color, no religious color. Uh, okay, uh, and uh, we have severe, severe political crisis and economic and financial crisis. Uh, Hezbollah uh, has the feeling, uh, with Amal, of course, his allied, of uh, a plot uh, uh, against uh, his presence and uh, 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 instead of uh, coming with this demonstration, which is right and and, usual, and especially for his uh, his uh, yeah, his supporters, uh, yeah, Hezbollah uh, did uh, did show uh, in several uh, uh, station and several times against this demonstration, those demonstration and this revolt. Uh, this is a matter of uh, controversy in Lebanon. Hezbollah pretend that its supporters did not face the demonstrator, uh, those amals, and Hezbollah is not ready in those moments to create a, a problem with his allied amals. Hezbollah, until now, is not accused to be corrupted, but is accused to, to protect uh, corruption, especially with his allies uh, and the other political class. In Lebanon, we have a very severe problem, internal, uh, external, regional, and international. We, uh, we don't have a government until now. And uh, I remember one month ago, I met the president of Lebanon for a long time, uh, only the two of us, and I did uh, suggest to him uh, several ideas to let the people evacuate uh, the uh, the streets, and he was very positive. Uh, but and I wrote an open letter in the newspaper and the mass media to the president uh, last week also to remind him of those ideas. I think it's very complicated. Is uh, is Yanni over the president's authority. Yeah, now Hisham, can we, we have, talk about that? Uh, Hisham, do, do you mind? The United States uh, to... Let's talk about uh, Michel Owen, the president, who you say you uh, met and you ahead. wrote an open letter to. Do you think he is out of his depth? Do you think someone else might have been able to do a better job? He spoke about six days ago. He said to the people of Lebanon, come and tell me what you want. He was supposed to meet with members of parliament right now on Thursday to talk about finding a replacement prime minister for Saad Hariri, but those talks are not happening today. Is, Mich is Michel Aoun mishandling the situation? I think, uh, yeah, yes, uh, you know, uh, the president failed. Uh... Okay, it looks as if we have lost that uh, line to our studio in Beirut. In fact, uh, just a shaky picture. And uh, if we can get Hisham back, we will. But uh, for the moment, let's leave it because of the technical problems we're having with Beirut.